What's up, intro web? You already know who I am. 100. You know I rep that intro media gaming. What's going on? What's going on? If you ain't done so, you can check out my last video I did yesterday. I just go live periodically. Um, if it's something that I want to say, I want to talk about, I am going to talk about it. Um, so, I was talking about Platinum Games and how Microsoft don't need to sell them motherfuckers shit. I don't keep it real. I don't sell them Nathan. Don't sell them a damn dime. If you're going to do, hit them over the head with it. Hit them over the head for scale bound because they messed up. They over there e-bagging. Platinum over there e-bagging. I talked about that. You know. We just had fun. You know, we have fun in my live chats. You know. Uh, yeah, I will be back on StreamYard. Stuff like that. It's just cold out here in L.A. And my office is cold. I don't feel like pulling out no heaters. So I'm like, man, just do it from where the place I make babies at. I'm talking about making babies. I only got one kid. What's good with you, junkie? You know. So, yeah, like I said, man, I hope Microsoft don't sell them a damn thing. Uh, this episode is not sponsored, but this is good from Ryan's Honey Crisp Apple Cider Vinegar Drink, man. I start drinking this, man, stuff. I've been on the kombucha. Uh, it's changed. You see, it make me brighter. I don't know I'm bright enough, but this stuff is good. Um, you can get it out at your local uh, grocery store. Um, it's organic. So, the stuff is good to me. I drink kombucha about like, I could say about three, four days a week. You know, help you with your digestive system and all that. But they need to sponsor my channel so I can promote them more. Come sponsor my channel, man. I don't care. Somebody come sponsor my channel. Um, also, description going to be in the description below. If you want to go someplace where you don't want to pay for Xbox Game Pass or Xbox Live, a whole bunch. Uh, CD keys. I haven't been sponsored by them for a while. Just some put it out there. I'll be forgetting. So go check out CD Keys. Uh, I'll leave it in my description below. Get a little discount. You get X Ultimate Xbox. Three months of Ultimate Xbox Game Pass. Uh, for a little bit of nothing. To tell you the truth. So go check out CD Keys. Um, go check out last week. GRG. I wasn't on there. I was in the morning. Uh, go check that out. Uh... Heroic Vibration Podcast probably be back on my man Flip Money channel. Uh, we talk about DC, Marvel, video games a little bit. Uh, TV shows, movies, comic books. Um, so, if I don't have to go to the office, I will be on there. Uh, like I said, I'm back after a week. I just needed to recharge my batteries. A lot of stuff been going on. You know, my man passed away, Kobe, and then... I, other stuff in my life that I don't mention on the interweb uh, was going on. And, you know, I just had to recharge. So I just took a week off of everything. Took a week off of everything. What's up with you, Cyrus Burke? So, um... It's reportedly out there that Sony is going to wait for Microsoft to announce the price of the Xbox Series X. Um, I think that's some kind of cowardly stuff. Why you just can't come? You announced your system first. So once you want to announce your price, why are you waiting? Why are you waiting? If, hey, Microsoft, if, hey, Phil, kill, Phil, Phil, if I was y'all, I wouldn't announce nothing to E3. So look, they're going to have to wait all this month until you announce that price. Don't announce nothing. We don't need no special shows. We don't need none of that. Phil, wait to E3. What Junkie say? He say, "Oh yeah, man, I don't, I don't see. That's why I don't, I don't. That's why you see. I'm starting using the word reportedly. You know what I'm saying? Because I don't report it. 
I'm not a, I'm not a uh, journalist. I'm just a, a video game talking shit YouTuber. What's good with your crews? You know, that's that. I mean, people were saying all since well, I think even early December it was like, well, in January now it was February now it's probably gonna be March, April, May that Sony is gonna show their hand. So, uh, you know, going to show you the price and all this. They're going to have this special show. And I guess Sony reportedly, they said, Sony said this. They're waiting on the price of the Xbox Series X. That's what I saw in certain articles that people that were reporting. Don't know if it's really true. Because you can't believe everything that you read. These days, you cannot believe it. So... Uh, you know, I see people running with it, you know, but if Sony, you doing that, come on, you sold your console first, dog, you got in me lines, what's up, what you good, man, what's up, what you mean, you know, so, so, Sony, you ain't got nothing, you had nothing for Christmas to show, with you went to CES and you you went to CES and showed a logo and you ran with these numbers is a hundred and eighty million trillion PlayStation 4s out there. The VR numbers were low. You know what I'm saying? What's good with you, Glass? The VR, the VR numbers were low. So I just don't I don't understand. You went on prime time to show a logo. That's the same logo. It's the same blue. It's just black and white. It ain't blue. It's just black and white. This ain't no Michael Jackson. Uh, this ain't no Ma Michael Jackson's. Uh, you no know saying video. It's black. It's white. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Why would you even announce that at CES? You you you're spending money on cars. Concept cars, Walkmans, cell phones that no one buys anymore. I don't know why they do that. I always get a phone call when I'm doing a live video. I'll be in there in a minute. I'll be in a party in a minute. That's why I'm like when people know I ain't at the office. They want to blow up my phone. At least the office send me emails. Ooh. I hit you back But nah it's just crazy But I don't see no one talking about that But they're giving Sony all these passes Why do you have to wait Go Think about it How many people force Will say Microsoft needs to show something They need to show games They need to show the console They need that And what, what Phil did The great Phil did this Phil hit him over the head We'll go to Xbox Series X at the Video Game Award. Jeff Keighley was 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 shocked. He only probably saw that probably maybe a thirty seconds before we saw it because they on a delay, and he was like, "What the frat? Showed you Hellblade that you had digital. I get us the Xbox for for what he made that word up digital fuckery." Going around trying to dissect the video. Then you got an old boy come back from vacation and reprise that they were wrong. But see, I don't see the PlayStation the PlayStation Nation on beat. They just take it. They just take it. Love it. Love it. Like M2D. When he found out his man was hitting on this girl. And they got that, that, uh, he got that motherfucking pool stick and shoved it up where the sun don't shine. Come on. He, he, he shoved it up. He spit on it and shoved it up. We know, Ke we know Kitty, you know, Jeff, we know Jeff is, is, is a pony. I mean, he loves, he loves his Kojimas. He loves his peoples. 
And there's nothing wrong with that. But the, the, but I don't see the PlayStation Nation forcing Sony hand. Sony's going to dominate. Sony's going to do this. Sony's in a restructuring mode. And people don't understand that. Everybody want to be engineers, software engineers, uh, that they got all these sources and all this other stuff. They got all these people. For one, I ain't even drinking. So don't call I'm drunk again. This is apple cider vinegar with then apple. So I want to hear all that. You drinking again. You pony again? You 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 damage controlling again? Cause see, when you come on prime time with me, I'm I'm I'm, 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 I'm I talk to my peoples. What my man say, Sony isn't in a better place. Uh, trying to read everything. Yeah, but, you know, Sony Sony is in restructuring. And, like I say, I, I run a business, I do all this. You can tell when somebody's restructuring. You can tell when somebody's restructuring what they're doing. And no one want to understand that. I can, when, when you, you sit there and people is, you know, I don't know what they be on sometimes, but they, they sit there and they damage control. Xbox don't have no games. Uh, this and this and that. I don't hear they go after the Nintendo fans. Nintendo fans get the same amount of exclusives we almost we get to. And they just buy them. Our games are, you know, got longevity. People still playing our exclusives. You know, I don't see no one playing God of War. I don't even see God of War you know, getting mentioned. Uh, Horizon Zero Dawn getting mentioned. You know, they threw Ghost of Tsushima. We ain't heard about that since last year. And eventually that's going to PC. If you really want to play it, you got got a little red. Go play it. But it's it, it's just crazy to me the funk that Xbox gets. But when Sony pulls off some shit like this, people just sweeping it under the carpet. They're not talking about it. Where your favorite YouTuber at with that emergency podcast at? Where they emergency clickbait at? That's acting like they know what the hell is going on and how many. That's what that's what I want. All the people saying about these uh, Sony's going to reveal this and reveal that and this date and this and that. Where are all these people that said they had these critical sources? Where are they at? Are they apologizing to their fan base, to their subscriber base to say that they're wrong? The sources was wrong. Everybody runs off this. See, think about this, that NeoGav, Reddick, that's another NeoGav somewhere too. And people are throwing up anything and it's, people can make stuff sound good and incredible. Till you hear it out the horse's mouth, like I said, I don't know what the PlayStation 5 has in it. Only thing I know it has a CPU that is made from AMD. That's all I know. That's all I know. Heard something about the controller. They're supposed to have half the feedback that Xbox has been having for how long? And their controllers? Come on now. But no one's talking about that. See, I'm going to talk about the greatness of Xbox. I'm an Xbox dude. I told you guys it took over the mantle of responsibility. I'm going to preach Xbox. I'm going to preach the Xbox because it's the best box. It's more bang. It's the more value and the more bang for your buck. I said this last night when I did went live last night. I said the same thing. Game Pass changed the game. When someone goes to a store, 
you can get over a you can buy one console and get over over 120 something games from first party titles from third from third party titles from uh indies and idea xbox games games that you would never try for either 10 or 15 bucks you can't beat that deal you can't beat that deal nowhere. That means you can go home and have access to all these games. You cannot do that on no other console. Cannot. Then if you have a PC, you got Game Pass PC. If you got Game Pass Ultimate. But everybody, oh, you cheap. You're broke. It ain't no got nothing to do with brokenness. It's called being real. And keep it in the book. Oh damn, I forgot the comments going so fast. Hell yeah, Fantasy Star Online this weekend. And everybody want to talk about these studios. Okay, we already saw the makers of Hellblade. What's up with you, King Joe Flesh? We saw the making, we saw the people from Hellblade. The wonderful people that made Hellblade. We saw them. Look what they did with a minor budget. They was borderline broke. If that game was to succeed. They would be out of business. Look at their budget now. Look at their budget now. So you're trying to say Hell, Hellblade 1 was up there with any AAA game that was up there. It was up there. Even though it was crazy for me to understand, but it was up there. So you can't, can't say, oh, you got to go bodies. How many people body big Studios and they bring out some flop, some some BS. Every studio, every studio that Microsoft, every studio that Microsoft down there bought, got new offices, new employees, new budgets. You hear that for a zombie act? They bought a zombie act and down there what? How many people that left a zombie act? And where they went to go work for? The big boy. They went to go work for Xbox. I didn't ask you to talk, Xbox. They went to work for Xbox. But no one wants to tell you that. Sony is in a restructuring format. That they got to figure out this money. Their movies is not hitting like they used to hit. They had to make a deal with Marvel and Disney. What up with Chewbacca? They had to make a deal with Marvel and Disney. And give Disney a bigger cut for them to do Spider-Man. Say that again. The initiative is snatching everybody up. And think about it. Would you want to stay in a cold place? Or you bring your ass out here to Santa Monica, California? Stay ass out here to Santa Monica, California, where you got a brand new building, brand new amenities, brand new technology. And think about it, Microsoft is selling it. Think about it, that's why they call it Microsoft Game Studios for a reason. Everybody's helping each other. You guys don't know how much, man, what was that? The Halo, uh, Master Chief Collection, and then they redid the uh, with Halo 2. They played Blur. A million dollar a cutscene, even though it was gorgeous. But they got what? Ninja Theory now to do that stuff now. And teach, and they can have the technology. Sony games look good because what? They do movies. Microsoft don't do movies. They do technology. That's why you got backwards compatibility so great. On the OG, the 360, the Xbox One. Now going to be on the Xbox Series X because what? That's what they do. 
So they do movies. That's why their games is so interactive. My damn son is just messing with me. Their games are so interactive. That's why their games are so movie. All these cutscenes. Because that's what they're doing. That's what they have already. Microsoft didn't have all that. Sony has writers that can write a good ass story. Microsoft is getting there. Halo is a great story. So Sony shut down. Sony shut down. Manchester. Oh, I must damn thing up. Uh, I'm trying to get the joint. Set it right. So Sony shut down Manchester. What? Let me go check. So Sony shut down Manchester Studios. I don't know what they made. So I don't know. I don't know what they made. Um, but they shut them down. Um, that means, hey, it's coming. It's restructuring coming. Like I say, I'm a piece of the truth. Good or bad, I'm a priest of truth. And the truth will set people free. Sony fans do not go after and check what the hell was going on. They don't. A lot of stuff been backfiring. I remember when Xbox started putting games on PC. Xbox started on PC. Microsoft started on PC. Why would you want to, why you can't get into that market and get some of that money? But Sony does it. Oh. But you don't see. Now, you won't see me do it. You won't see me do it at all. And I don't want no Xbox fans to do it at all. Don't go in no pro PlayStation channel. Uh, or somebody that's neutral or whatever. And say that PlayStation don't have no games. Because they came on this channel so many times saying that Xbox doesn't have any games. And I'm like, how can you prove that? Have the same games down there what you have. Oh, they made VR games. And that's what I'm trying to see. And Sony VR did not sell like that. It didn't. VR is not for everybody. I have VR. I have a quest. I have it. But I cannot game on there like I can game on a console. Eventually, it will wear you out. I mean, my man Sink said he always talk about that's what they do. But see, like I say, this is a new year. It could be a new year any day of the year. And it's ain't got this what the world say this is a new year, but it's a new year. And like I said, I'm going to come and I'm going to come hitting. I'm going to come firing. Because I get people sending me stuff and I'm like, why are you sending me this stuff? I don't care. I don't do clickbait. I don't do Patreon, even though I do have one. Um, I don't do that. You don't need a Patreon to play with me. You don't need this. To, I'm not doing exclusive content. For you, just because you a Patreon, we should treat everybody, I treat all my subscribers equal. I don't care what you like, I treat you all equal. I talk to everyone. I talk to everyone, and that's what you should be. On that Obsidian game, man, I can't, like I said, I can't wait to eat through that. I'm, I'm, I thought I was hyped last year. I'm super hyped this year. Like I said, I'm taking two weeks off from the uh, office. I ain't doing nothing for two weeks. It's going to be nothing but gaming. Last year, I was on call. I had to take some phone calls. But other than that, I'm gaming. Y'all going to see coverage uh, from us. You know, you're going to see coverage from all of us. 
from the TRX crew, from GRG, from me, from everybody we kind of know. That's going to be there. You're going to see it. It's going to be some joint ventures. It's going to be, hey, we finna have a ball. I can't wait. I just can't wait. Like I say, we already got stuff turning now. 108 got everything paid for. He, he couldn't wait. Like me, I'm forced to not live out here in L.A., so I'm at, it's, I just got to show up. You know. Just want to have a good time. Man, Outer Worlds was so surprising. Yeah, we'd be at E3 this year, like we was at last year. We'd be there. We're going to be there. Live in the charts. Man, you come to E3, man. Come to E3, man. You welcome that. Man. Like I say, I'm supposed to be cooking again this year. So, getting on the grill. I'm getting on the grill again. I don't know what day, but I'm going to be getting back on the grill. You know. Here we go. I, he always come in here, the notorious, notorious, heartless, Christopher Pony Heart. Wants to come in again and talk all that rhetoric. PlayStation 5 is not a real gangster. How are you going to be a gangster where you waiting for your competitor to put out a price? Do I see TCL does that? Do you see uh, Toshiba? I mean, not Toshiba. Uh, man, what's another T? Any electronic wait on another company to put out a price? Hell no. You don't see that. You don't see that at all. And like I said, Microsoft, wait to E3. They didn't want to show up to E3. Wait to E3 to reveal everything. Let them motherfuckers wait. They want to play. Think about it. They want to play chess. Let's play chess. And you hit them with a checkmate. Hit them with a straight checkmate. Oh, oh, Pony Hart gonna be up there. He gonna be sitting there at E3 waiting on the uh he gonna be waiting on E3 when he the only one in a in a uh in the theater by himself because they ain't having one. But remember, E3 wasn't and nobody wants to go to E3. E3 is garbage. E3 don't have no people. I can show proof. Why do Sony not need to go to E3? Everybody else does. Even Nintendo do is at E3. They just don't have a conference. Like I said, I'm waiting. You know what I'm saying? Any up. Christopher, you so big of a pony. I I get you you you. I heard Bomb be having the, the corporate slave of the year. You need to be on that list. How are you going to blow everything away? Microsoft already know what they have. Why? Because their online service is coming on Azura servers. Microsoft already knows what's in their box. They already know what's in their box. They already know, dog. Sorry to tell you. Sorry, sorry. I'm trying to tell you. It's your last year. It's your last year of NBA, NBA uh, of the show. Your last year to be exclusive. And what? What did the MLB do? They pushed you, they pushed you all, they pushed your cards. They pulled your card. They wanted to stay was at the poker table. 
And they told them, they told you to show your cards and made you do something that you didn't want to do. Because why? Nobody buys the show. No one buys the show. But guess who was there waiting? EA was there waiting to make that deal. 2K was waiting right there to wait for that deal. Sony had no choice. Sony been spending money that they don't have like that. You got to understand, Sony is not just PlayStation. Sony does Walkman says $1,500 to $2,700. They're doing cars for some damn reason. Nobody told them to be no Tesla. They still selling cell phones. Their movies are not making grossing the money that they usually gross. Come on now. They put all their money in the third party advertising. Like I say, it's a, it's 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 amazing why you see Sean Layton all of a sudden just up and leave. I'm telling you, it was a coup. Jim Ryan pulled a coup. Only person that's there is Cerny, and they got him in the basement trying to figure out how to fix fake HDR on the regular PlayStation 4. Come on now. Even Jim, when he get on the stage, the CS didn't even sound like a great presenter. Like, why would you even have him up there? Let's keep it a buck. See, people like Chris, people like Pony Hart. Let Sony get away with that bull. And that's why they keep on getting hit with no Vaseline. With no Vaseline. When 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 you see your, any of their executives even talking to their, asking what their consumer wants. They tell you guys what you want. They told you they didn't, you didn't need EA access. They told you you didn't need this. They told you to, you know what I'm saying, to hold two dildos, you know what I'm saying, in your hand to play PlayStation VR. They told you and you'd agree to it. No one's talking to you guys. You demoted your cheetah like it wasn't Nathan. Phil talks to people. Aaron talks to people. Shannon talks to people. 343 talks to people. When it, when it, I don't see a zombie that talking to nobody. Unless they saying they're going away. I got another job. I'm going to work for Xbox. That's what they got going on over there. They don't talk to their consumer. They don't know what their consumer wants. Cause they force it on you. They force it down your throat. And y'all take it. Y'all take it like that pool sticking in too deep. Love it. Love it. But y'all don't keep it real with yourself, man. Y'all don't keep it a buck. Y'all sit, y'all sit there and whatever Sony dishes out, tell you to love it. Y'all know y'all didn't like that bullshit called whack. Oh, my bad, Knack. I didn't like that. Don't say you did. It was whack, and it gave you a sequel. And the sequel was worse than the first one. But y'all took that. What's that other... What's that other game y'all had with, like, with, with the, the sandbag dude? That was like a fake Project Spark? Uh, what's that shit called? The little sandbag dude. That little ugly dude. Y'all accepted it. And y'all threw it on y'all list of exclusives that y'all don't buy. That y'all do not buy.
My man Vodka said, he said, uh, Sony is quitting. E skipping E3 because they ain't got nothing to show. Yeah, little blick planet. Y'all accepted that dog shit. Y'all accepted it. Y'all accept anything that Sony throws at you. But then the Xbox, if I get up on the Xbox, guys, they cry about every damn thing. They cry about everything. Little Big Planet wasn't no smash hit. What? Oh, come on. Woo, y'all be y'all be trying to move that gold post, but you can't move it on here. This ain't the XFL. This ain't the XFL. You can't move that gold post, dog. No. No, come on, keep it a buck. Dreams. Yep, Dreams is Project Sport. That's what Dreams is. What's up with your Kings Gaming? Rohan. Platinum just want to finish Scalebound. Platinum had a chance to finish Scalebound. They took the church's money. They took the church's money. That's the, that's the church's money. It's Xbox and used it for other games. Now they eat begging. I wouldn't sell them a damn thing. If I'd sell them, I'm, you got to give me your company. You want to finish this game? I need 85% of your company. I'm keeping it real. Come on. Talking about Platinum just want to finish something. Platinum needs to go finish ain't it with another Bayonetta. Look all them games they got out there. They ain't supporting Xbox. It how it's going to go multi-plat. Microsoft own that IP. Microsoft is not going multi-plat. Because they will never get it. Because they can't afford to buy it. Platinum cannot buy. Okay, if Platinum can buy Scalebound from Microsoft, why they e-begging to do a wonderful one-on-one? -on -one? And putting on everything else but Xbox. Come on. I'm keeping it real. They're e-bagging. Because you guys, all them games, they don't, y'all don't buy them. Y'all don't buy them. Y'all put them on y'all list like y'all buying them. Y'all buy them when they go in the bargain bin. I wouldn't sell platinum nothing. You're going to make wonderful one-on-one, but you won't put it on Xbox, but you put it on everything else? Come on. No. I don't remember what platinum say. Platinum can kiss. Platinum can kiss. My narrow ass. Pause. I'm just keeping it real. I wouldn't sell platinum. Gonna have to give me 80% their company if they want to finish that game. There's other people. Microsoft has all the things. Like I said, when Microsoft cut, when Phil cut that cord, they cut it for a reason. They cut it for a reason. They cut it for a reason because they was taking the church's money. Promised them something that they couldn't promise. I'm keeping it in a buck. They couldn't promise it. And you, as a business person, you don't accept that. 
That's a business deal. And you probably, you got consumers that's looking forward to playing that game. But they were using the other money to fund other projects. And Phil came over and was like, I got to cut the funding, dog. And then I'm going to let my attorneys handle the rest about how getting some of my money back. And matter of fact, uh, I need everything that you got from Scalebound. I need all that. I need the, I need everything. I need the code. I need all that. I'm taking it with me because I own it. And that's all Phil did. Phil didn't go in there bulldogging. They didn't put him down either. Didn't said that Platinum was a bad company or nothing like that. They just took it business wise. That's called business. How do not Microsoft don't know how to how do not how Microsoft don't know how to treat developers? What's up with you, Matty Ice? What's up with you, Rain? Microsoft do not know how to treat developers. That's crazy. Okay, that's crazy. It was amazing. They don't know how to treat developers. What's good with you, bro? They don't know how to treat developers of damn. I saw Ed Boom. When I was at on the Microsoft stage, I saw other people. I saw EA on the stage. Come on now. They don't know how to treat people. Now, Rohan, y'all want to go talk these numbers. I'm going to put it this way. The numbers are always supposed to go down because you're going to bring out a new system. Mostly everybody has an Xbox already or a PlayStation or, or a Switch. So the numbers are going to go down. What are you talking about? They forecast this stuff. And they forecast this stuff. They know what's going on. You act like Xbox went broke. Xbox made money. They just didn't make money what they made the year before. So, so y'all love to go talk about these numbers, acting like y'all money marketing analysts. Y'all ain't doing it, taking y'all asses on the website or listening to another YouTuber that know how to articulate or know how to regurgitate something that they read and think they know all of it. No, they ain't have no high school. They ain't ready to even have a high school education. But y'all go back and listen and bring y'all asses back on my channel acting like y'all highly educated. No, it don't work that way. I'm keeping it real. It don't work that way. But people, that's what people want to believe. You can't super chat because I don't do super chat on my channel, dog. I appreciate it. I don't. Uh... I don't cut on Super Chat because there's no reason for me to cut on Super Chat, man. You know, I do this shit, I do this shit for the love. I don't do this for the money. Uh, I do it for the love. I appreciate it. Um, you can go on GRG. Mega has on his channel. He has Super Chat on. But I don't cut on Super Chat because uh, YouTube is going to take 8% of the revenue anyway. So... It's not for me to, it's not, it's some stuff that's not used for me to cut on. It's not used for me to come on. What's good with you, Mr. Franks? Mr. Thomas Franks. What's good with you, man? Yeah, they said me, yeah, they said that they closed the studio now. Man, I, feel, I thank you, man, Emmanuel. Man, I try to be, I just try to be, man. I've been in this game for a while. I just, I just, you know, I got, we not, we not broke for money and stuff like that. 
I'm not going to play that game. I, 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 I'll tell people, and Megan gets mad at me when I say this, I tried to be the best barbecue pit master before I best to be the YouTube, YouTube star. I, I'm keying real. I'd rather be the next barbecue pit master. It's more longevity into that. Anybody can be, anybody can do this YouTube stuff. Yeah, I'll be at E3 this year. We already got plans. Buying gadgets. I probably go go cam, cell phone, you know, 108. Got the DSL, DSLRs. Uh, we, we doing it. Man, I don't know what's going on with these. Man, they, they damage controlling. Damage controlling, man. So, like I say, that's my that's my other than video games. My other hobby is barbecuing, and I, I I I'm damn good at it. You know what I'm saying? I, I try to do the best I can on the grill. I'm supposed to be cooking this E3 again. Last year we did it small. The year before last, I did it super big. But this year I'm doing it real big. It's E3. 343 is making a new IP. 343 is Halo. That's all they're going to make is Halo. Turn 10. That's all they're going to make is, is, is Dan, is um, Forza. The Coalition, only thing they're going to make is Gears. That's what they're good at. When you focus on one thing, you can make that IP great. Instead, so you got multiple. Now, some people can do multiple things, like, uh, like uh, what you call that? Uh, I was playing that E3. Uh, let me go see. I got that damn game. Damn my stuff. Uh, um, let me go. I think I still have to delete the. I did delete the beta. I think they're supposed to cut it on. I think they gave it to me already. I just can't play it. Uh. Uh, where you at? Uh, I can't think of that game. I hate. That's why I be drinking, because I be thinking. Oh, uh, shit. What is that game called? Uh, yeah, I got the updates. I get I get all them um crazy updates. I get them every Monday and every I think I get updates every Monday, every Wednesday. Cause I'm in the Alpha Alpha Insider program. Yeah, Ninja Theory new game. Well, I think I got I can think of it. But Ninja Theory new game. They coming out. But Ninja Theory, they were already working on that game. Bleeding Edge. Yeah, Bleeding Edge. Bleeding Edge is a different game. I know some people are not gonna like it. They're gonna talk about it. I try to give many codes I got. He bought what's good with you, he bought. I try to give away many codes I could. I asked for codes, they gave me codes. Played in the alpha. The only reason I didn't play in the last few alphas because of other games that was coming out. And they started that alpha and they beta right then and there. And I'm like, and they hit me up like, man, you ain't been on. I'm like, because too many other games don't play. But Bleeding Edge is, you got to try Bleeding Edge if you got game passes in there day one. And no, this is not beer. This is apple cider vinegar with some apple. Some apple honey crisp. So I went, oh. I don't hate nobody. Yeah, we get them damn updates. And like I said, I mean, I'm, like I, I, I update before. Like Monday, as soon as I come back from the office, I update. I was going straight up, get it out the way. Get it out the way. So, they throw them updates. They try to fix bugs. 
Uh, I also do all my, what you call that? I do all my, you know, send the stuff, you know, my all my, what you call that? Missions or rewards and stuff. I do all that stuff, man. And then they reward me, give me in certain betas. I can't wait for that fantasy star online this weekend. It's going to be fire. I tell, I say, man, I'm going to put it this way. Let me give it a buck with you. Hunter is a character that I portray. I say things on here. I just say it. I'm entertaining. I want, I want you to have a day off or you're sitting in your office or you're doing something. I want to entertain. I don't want to be no boy. Like I say, the average consumer don't know nothing about a damn teraflop. They don't know what a GPU means. What's good with you, star boy? They don't know what a GPU means. They don't know what a CPU means. They don't even know what the what RAM means. They don't know what RAM does. But when they hear some another person talks about it, acting like they know about it, it's different. I don't want to be on here. I'm I live in the tech world. So I do when I go to the office. I have my own business. It's a, it's a computer repair business. I know it. I don't like to talk about it. Yeah, man, I'm back, man. I had to go away for a minute to, you know, recharge my batteries. I was around. Just wasn't participating in nothing. They had the energy. You know, ain't the Final Fantasy supposed to be coming in? All them Final Fantasy that nobody, remember you guys didn't want to play old games? Nobody want to play old games. I'm going to play the Final Fantasies that's not turn-based. I'm not a turn-based Final Fantasy. I'm not a turn-based Final Fantasy dude. Not going to, it ain't happening on my, not on my watch. Won't, I'm not doing no turn-based. Now, if it's like the last Final Fantasy, I enjoyed the hell out of that. Me and not this in the crew. Man, man, man. We was doing it big. Only thing I just didn't like the ending, and I'm not spoiling it for you gotta watch it because it was an ending that like it's not like I never saw before. That's all I'm gonna say like that. It reminded me of a movie ending. But like I say, it's about looking for greatness. Okay, I've tried to play Lost Odyssey. It was different. It was different. Uh, it was it it, it was it, it just it just takes some time to get used to. I played through. Think about it: is the first damn boss is hard. It took me it took me about three days to beat that boss. You say it's bone and dog counsel. No, dog actually has a girlfriend now. So. He spent times with a girlfriend, and then when he do come, he came over here. Dog was over here Thursday, but his girlfriend came over. So his girlfriend came through. So yeah, it's about damn time. So and his girlfriend don't live out here, so he be going back out there with her. Uh, he, I'm on my, what you call it. I'm not using um, StreamYard. I'm using just the regular um, YouTube app off my phone. If I would have known, I would have I would have tried to do StreamYard from my phone or set in my cold-ass office that I don't feel like sitting in. Or yeah, I don't mind the last, I see like even Blue Dragon. I, I, I tried out Blue Dragon, but I'm not really a super turn-based guy. My, I'm going I'm to keep it a buck with y'all. The last turn-based RPG that I beat was Wild Arms on Nintendo. That's the last turn-based RPG I beat. I just not into turn-based, but you'll hear something different like Mega Lights turn-based. I don't.
I should play. I played God of War. It's cool. It's cool. I don't mind sitting back. Like even with what was that Final Fantasy Seven, the 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 oh the um the original one on PlayStation. Let's go, with my boy. I was some watch him play it. I watched him play it. I wasn't like oh it's it, it's it goes to shit. I watched him play it. I played the last of us. I have played PlayStation games. No, I haven't played that. Like even what's called it, uh, Gears Tactics. I probably won't be playing that because I don't like the tactical. I don't like that. That's just me. That's my preference. I don't like that. I like full control of my care. I don't want you to slide. Matter of fact, what just came out? What's the game came out? Uh, uh, Pillars of Pillars of Eternity Two. It's turn base. I'm gonna try to play it. The story was good. I just gotta get in the mood. To, I gotta get in the mood. I got Resident Evil Two remake. I have played it. Rohan, I hold a whole lot of games. I just, some games, just, I put more time into them than others. I'm just being real. Like, like Final, like, uh, what you call it? That's not turn-based. So I like that because I have control of that character. I tell that character what to do. Uh, Black Desert, you got to go check out my man Vodka. My man Vodka got some... You know what I'm saying? He on he on a different desert. He on like on five deserts. I can play that type of game because I control the character. I choose what to up to, uh, to upgrade. I I choose what to do. You know, people don't like Halo Wars. I like Halo War. I like them type of games because I already know what I'm getting into. But some people didn't like Halo Wars because it wasn't traditional Halo. So, I don't know. I, I might give it a try. Like I say, it comes free. I, I give every game a try. I give every game a try. Yeah, that's real time strategy. I. I don't mind playing them. Because I know, I already know what I'm getting into. And thing about it is, it's time for me. It's like, I'm focused, but I ain't have to be super focused. I like the multiplayer on there. I don't know what happened. Me, live, and a couple of men, we used to battle. We went like two days just straight battling on Halo Wars. Against each other. We was we were some battling mother foes, man. Yeah, so I just want to have man. Like I say, I play a whole lot again. I got games like man. I remember when PUBG came out and it was in which color. And I've got this game. Me and Live got this game called the Calling, and it's just kind of like PUBG, but it ain't like PUBG because you got to craft your weapons. You got to put two rocks together with a stick to make a, a, a hammer. You got to do a whole lot of stuff. But the game, it clo the, the map closes at the same at the same time. Some people sit there and crab, bow and arrows, all type of stuff. I played that and it was cool until PUBG came out. PUBG just came out. I can go back to the colon. But I liked it for what it was. It was like a, it was like a game. Was matter of fact, if you ever saw the Running Man with Arnold Schwarzenegger in there, that's what it was. Mortal Kombat. You say what sequels do I want? I just want games. I don't care about sequels. I just want to play them. Um, Battle Toads look good. You know, I like, you know, I like Battletoads. 
It looked great. That line was long. I like the battle toads. I don't care about the shell shading, all this other garbage. Um, let me hit up with a shoot. I want anything, man. Just give me something. Just give me something to play. We got shit to play now. Like, I look at my back catalog sometime and I be wanting to cry. You know? I'm still trying to get through Dead Cells. That's, that game crazy. But when I get in the mood, I, I go in it. I go in there and I try to wipe it out. Um, xCloud, I'll probably be playing what you call it. So if you see me on during the day, tomorrow I'm going to be on my Xbox. I'll be on xCloud. And I'm going to be playing Destiny. I'm going to try to go through the Destiny story mode. Like I said, I got the crew. The only reason I think I got the crew, I think that's EA. I think my, uh, my brother got, well, my son got that. He wanted it on here. Uh, Children's of Mortar. I try to get into that. That's something else. I, I, I try these games. I try these games. Um, that new Contra game is dog shit. That Contra Road Corpse. No, not for me. Um, what else? No, I've been playing. I beat the I beat Borderlands. That Borderlands DLC. I know why it's kind of like fifty bucks for the for the uh, DLC. I just paid for the one. I know why because that DLC is long as hell, and it's, and it's a different story. It's more weapons and stuff like that. But since I'm super juiced up. I kind of didn't, I almost, almost ran through it like, like cheese, but the, the last boss kind of, I found out a little glitch when the boss did something and I aired him out. Had to put some bullets together. Mm -mm. Had to put some bullets together and, and, and air them out. But uh, like I said, I play Brawlhalla. Even though I don't like they, how they, they, they do their characters. Uh, my boy had me buy this game called Bush League Hockey. I, I should sock him for that one. He owed me a game for that one. This is the first year I've been playing Call of Duty multiplayer. Haven't played Call of Duty multiplayer in a very, 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 very long time. A very long time. Um, the Castlevania games I want to get back into too. Comic Zone I ain't gonna never beat that game. I ain't gonna never beat that game. Crackdown, I'm, I'm, I'm crackdown. I'm waiting a hundred percent crackdown. It is some games that is hard to beat. Crackdown, I'm crackdown. I'm, I think I'm missing one agent that I have to find, and then I, that's a hundred percent on that campaign. I ain't never hundred percent a crackdown. And I hundred, I love this crackdown because they knew what it was. It was funny. It was action based. It was just fun. The Stranger Things. I haven't gotten into that. I haven't gotten into them. Life is strange. I ain't got into them yet. I want to play Dauntless. I just don't have the time to put in. Devil May Cry 5. I, I want to get back into that. It's a bunch of games. Doom, I'm trying to beat Doom. I think I'm close to the end on Doom. I think I'm real close to the end. Dragon Ball Z Fighters. I got to get back into that. Got all the characters. Mostly. You know, playing back Halo, just going through, man. Stuff that home front, I'm kind of, people don't really like home front. I like it home front. Jump Force, only reason I ain't me, only reason you don't see me playing Jump Force where I'm supposed to be playing Jump Force because it needs some English dub. That's how the East do us wrong. They don't give us no English dub, man. 
I don't, I'm tired of reading. Tired of that. Tired of all that reading. But let me get my, I'm been on here for an hour. I ain't going to keep y'all too long. Appreciate y'all coming by. Uh, probably go live Thursday. Got to go to the office tomorrow. So probably got to go to live. Go, I'll go live Thursday. Thursday or Friday, I'll go live again. I'm going to give y'all more content. Be doing more stuff. Uh, might be doing a giveaway. You can check me out on Twitter. Mixer. You know, um, I'll be on Xbox Live. I changed my name. I'm not, my name is Hunted Kobe now. So you can check me out there. Um, I'm going to start doing more on Mixer. I'll probably do that when I'm not at the office. This game. But uh, y'all be cool, man. And uh, shout out to everybody that rocked out. And uh, this is your boy, Mr. Keep It A Buck. I'm out.